Okay, welcome to RimWorld. We just had to start over. The last series is over. We attempted to get a ship built, and that did not happen. Uh, it ended in misery, pain, and suffering. So, we're going to start over. This is going to be a more of an introduction to the colony video. We'll get started with building uh, bedrooms and the like. Uh, it says the three of you awake in your cryo crypto sleep sarcophagi to the sound of sirens and ripping, mil 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 ripping metal. You barely get to escape pods before the ship is torn apart. <clears throat> We're in an unknown rim world. We need to make our plans to survive. So, I think this time, well, let me introduce everyone. This is an herbalist named Fuentes, or Buffy. Uh, incapable of social, she is also mute, apparently. Uh, very good in medicine, good enough anyway. Shooting melee, also decent. Rinnick was a childhood athletic, and she became a stiletto assassin. Uh, very good at melee, very good at shooting, uh, loves them both, also good at medicine, a little bit of research. And then we have uh, Tail, who was a shun girl. She is only 18. She is beautiful, but also nervous, but she is a hard worker. Um, she is okay at shooting. I think what we'll do right off the top, and I mean right after... we uh, allow all this stuff here. We'll set up what we need to do. We have Rink, Rinnick here on the survival tail on the pistol. And um, we'll start setting up zones. This time around, what I want to do, if at all possible, is figure out a way to avoid the monkeys, number one but also get to a ship and or build a ship. I settled south, hoping that no matter where the ship that we can walk to is, won't be across water, for one, and uh, it won't be in some frozen tundra, hopefully. Hopefully the farthest point is over here or over here, or directly over here. And um, of course, we'll see how that uh, happens. So first, let's look at what we've got here, our little square. We've got a giant impassable mountain, hopefully impassable to our enemies, and then a couple of mountainous areas here. It looks like the best, I, best thing to do would be to go kind of into this mountain uh, for resources and that kind of thing. However, mining takes a long time, so I want to get just a base of operations, which I think is going to be right over here where we can guard ourselves from um, unhappy people. We are playing Phoebe, or no, sorry, we're not. Let's see, world somewhere it tells you we're okay. So we're playing Phoebe Chillax on rough and pause the game, obviously. Uh, we've got no major threats, no enemy raids. Uh, colonists need beds, obviously. No damage taken, no colonists killed, and none have been lost, launched into space. So, I think what we'll do is we will put just a dumping zone right over here, outside of where we're going to be working. Kind of big. We tend to get a lot of stuff. And we'll just allow everything for now and um, get them to start moving everything. We're going to do manual priorities because I want them all to firefight and all to be a patient. Ow, double click much. Uh, and you will definitely be a doctor when we need a doctor, and you will be a doctor if we ever need a doctor. And then everyone can go on bed rest, everyone can flick, that's not that hard to do. You can be a warden when it's important, hunting will be important, uh, or cook. It's going to be her, apparently. You will be cooking quite regularly. Uh, and we'll set up the rest later after they start getting everything done. Is that? That's a capybara. 
don't think they're dangerous. I have not really played on this before, so I don't exactly know. But let's go ahead and chop down all the wood that's available there. We are going to want to get this roofed, and I do believe we have wood. We will have wood. So let's get ourselves set up here. We might even just put this inside, but <clears throat> first things first, I want to do a couple of bedrooms. So we'll come here. If we do 24, that'll be 23, right? <clears throat> And then uh, go 11 here. Just build this whole thing. Get it done as fast as we can, hopefully. And we'll put in a couple of doors, different spots, so they have different ways in and out. And that will entire thing will be a bedroom for now. <clears throat> and we will mine all this out. Uh, um, construction is going to be important. For everyone, put all on three there. Hauling is not that important, but hopefully they get. We have wood already, so we ought to be okay. Um, package five meals. We're going to want to set up a kitchen quickly to get some food. Are these all women? Yeah, all three are women. So that will be how that's going to be. We want to haul this out of the way. We want to haul all this out of the way. Who is our animal? It is a Yorkshire, which means it's going to be completely useless for hauling. Hey, that's fine. Maybe we'll just wall off this little area here for the kitchen. Put a door. Um, here, here, all here, and we'll mine out this little area here. And we'll make this <clears throat> a kitchen area, not the slaughter area. We're going to do the slaughter separate. We're going to want to roof this um, quite quickly. So I think we'll just do a wall here. that done. <clears throat> they are also getting wood, which is great. Hmm. Steam guys are right there. It's going to be perfect. Okay, it is getting to be, what time? 16th hour. Let's go ahead and get a few wood beds in here. Um, we're going to put them here, 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 and of course we'll get that walled off eventually. I think I'm going to try to keep everything inside this time around so that we can, uh, oh, you need that knife, wherever that went to. That's still up here. Equip that. Perfect. There's still a bunch of stuff flying up around here. Nothing that needs to be taken care of, I don't think. So we'll go ahead and fix the Build roof area here. Perfect. And tail, what are you doing? Hollywood. Materials. Okay. Well, they might be sleeping on the ground, but let's uh, at least get them inside if it's possible. Don't know that it's going to be possible, but we're going to give it a shot. See if we can get him inside so we don't have that complaint. Perfect. We do need them to yeah, fill it all you can. And then, <clears throat> as I love to do here, I'm going to give them two hours of essentially free time. One hour that of that free time will be 
or joy only when they wake up or they go to sleep. Perfect. Maybe they get this now. Okay, well. Where did two tails go? She's smart enough to build her own bed, apparently. Right. <clears throat> not, not that way. All right. So first day, what did we get done? Well, we roofed our stuff that we need to store, so that's good. We built almost the entire wall of what will be in the future bedrooms, probably on either side, and we've got the beginnings of where we're going to cook our food. Also, in security-wise, we do not have anything for security. I don't know how, uh, what our threats are going to be. You have these two people who are extremely uh, hostile, but maybe if we heal their captures, they will be okay. We've got a ton of marble, a ton of steel lying around. This is probably going to be a pretty good deal. Down to 21 meals, so we're going to want to start getting some stuff butchered, taken care of. We will do that. We'll do a fueled stove here. And we will take care of the floor so that it's not a disaster. We're going to need lights and stuff, but we'll get there eventually. What, why is this? Oh, those are the sleeping spots, right? We don't want to build too much stuff because I want them to get... Okay, they're going to do this first anyway. Good. We might even go ahead and do this wall across here. Uh, we're going to give them pretty spacious rooms. Did not make them anywhere near even, but hopefully they won't mind too much. And we'll put a, I'm gonna put a hallway here. Perfect. Yeah, that's the door, right? Yeah. So actually, we don't need that. I waste the wood. Perfect. That ought to get things done for today, and uh, we'll get some hunting in, get some meat. We just need electricity. Eventually, it looks like power is going to end up being fuel generator for now, just so we can. Um, why do I want the fuel generator? I don't. Not yet. Don't do that yet. Uh, Fientus. Hauling is obviously way up there on the priorities list. It's a three. Why are they not constructing them? It's going to be a three here. Tailoring, not important. Hauling is very important. Oh, research, right. We will want to research. So, simple research bench. Here. And we'll get wood. I don't think it requires power. Well, they're sleeping outside again. That's alright. This order is not to be followed 100%, please. It does think that they are sleeping in the rain, but that's how it is right now. They should need everything or something. I don't know. They could have done things differently, but right now, I'm not too concerned. We're in a jungle kind of area. I didn't really show you. Um, where are we? Here we are. So, we look. Not there. Let me... Oh, can I not... Uh, here we are. Terrain. So, it's mountainous. Um, and we will be able to... Uh, grow year-round, get plenty of rain, but it does see disease is a constant threat here. Hmm. 
He does have aggressive. Oh, I didn't read any of this. Dense and overgrowth and aggressive wildlife make construction and survival difficult. Oops. Well. That's. We'll make it interesting. I'm not too concerned because we're going to research defenses uh, pretty quickly when they get this uh, little house thingy built. All three of them, the ladies, ought to be just doing what they can to get things done. Also, another thing I want, which is a not a sculpture's table, but a stone cutter's table. Um, and I don't mind making that outside. Get some wood. So we have plenty of steel. We don't have any wood because as soon as they chop it, they are using it, and that's fine. Pretty sure we are going to deep into the depths of this mountain for our home, and we'll leave this for first defense is awesome. Two out of three beds is perfect. They are going to need uh, more trees to chop. Might as well just get everything that's close. Okay. Um, this is all marble. Crazy. But that's fine. We will make marble blocks. And we will do it until we have I uh, did 210 of them or so. We also, we want to... Hey, we have visitors. Cool. Cook simple meals. I want to have a, at least 30 of them. If at all possible. And who do we have? West, Woznot, Woznoter. They're visiting. They have a couple of things to trade. Uh, two out of three of our ladies, I believe, are unable to be social. So Tail will be our little social lady stop. You've got to build the bed. There we go. I think it's, think that completes that entire building. It does. Okay. Would you mind talking to Mata, Maida, whatever her name is? And let's just see what they've got. I don't have much to trade, but uh, we'll talk to them. They have three lavish meals, and they have components, and that's it. Okay. I mean, if we bought all three, it'd be $165. That's a lavish meal piece. You'll do it. Stop tail. Stop tail. When you buy something, it'd be very helpful if you just went and got it. what I think. We're going to set this to butcher forever. Every time we have an animal, please butcher it. And then in the morning... Wait a second. How would you do that? There we go. It's real. It can be Radic... Whatever her name is, and it can be uh, Fredis. Fuentes. And Rick. Sorry, Rick. Isn't that much better? And then dog can just sleep out there. Uh, get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that, and good morning. They're leaving. They provided us with a couple of simple meals. We need a refrigerator, that's the reason I built this. So, the ladies think we ought to name our faction. Faction, what should be faction? We can be, uh, I don't know. We will be the Women Rule Faction. And this particular community is going to be the women. For now. So the women are going, that's easy because that's easy to remember. And I can just say the women when I'm talking about this place. Alright, let's hunt that. No, we'll, we'll want to hunt this too, but one thing at a time. Well, that was super easy. Renick, good job. This will be indoors eventually. Um, we're going to want more marble. 
chunks of marble is. So let's go ahead and haul that. I don't think we have any marble chunks yet. Let's go here, so. Mm. Yeah, get that done, Renna, because we want somebody researching. Uh, we'll give them a wood chair to sit on while they are researching. Just put chairs everywhere, because I don't know how it works. So that'll spoil in a day if it's not used, and our meals will spoil in three days if not refrigerated. So we want to make sure to stay on top of that so that we can, uh, not die. And I believe Rick is our researcher. She is. So we're going to make sure that she starts to research uh, things that will help us. Oh, mad animal. Local tortoise. Okay, so this needs to be hunted. Um, tail. You could go ahead and get on that. And this needs to be hauled. Should have not been not hauled. Oh, Linux, come on. It's getting dark. She's gonna start missing. One dead 19 hours. So she's probably gonna go to sleep for 20 hours and we'll be alright. No food. Well, thank you. We do only have nine, ten meals, eleven meals, ten meals now. So we want to get cooking done. All right, so that needs to be filled. We don't have. Okay, so there's more wood to be had there. There is future. She's going for a walk. That is fine. There's some coarseway leather. Okay, so let's go ahead and start the research project. Um, I think, what do we want to do? I reckon we are going to want to want pen up. Eh. Let's go ahead and we'll get the ladies carpet after the passive cooler. So, um, Rennick, Rennick, you can um, do that when you wake up. And we want to have a pretty growing zone right here. Is that a good idea? No, it is not. Delete that. We want a new growing zone right here. Just outside. We're now pick up all this marble. 8 by 20. It can be. That's fine. Also, I want a growing zone over here. It's going to be 8 by 8. This is going to be trees. I like. Let's see. That's fine. It can be a sepia or poor tree. That's fine. Potatoes will be grown. Oh, a snake. Cobra. Not good. Um, tail. Harvest. Harvest. Okay. I need you to fill this, and whoever's supposed to be cooking, that needs to be done real fast. Uh, cooking. Cooking too. Okay. So yeah, make sure to cook Fuentes. Very good. Thank you. And we will go ahead and unforbid that, so we can get some power to where is essentially going to be our refrigerator, which we'll put here. So we'll square this off there. The door here. And this will be our refrigerator as soon as they get done with all that. <coughs> hey, Rogers. A male guy. He just joined. He is a janitor. Wow. Loves to shoot. Loves construction. Loves crafting. And he came with a shiv. Great. That is good news. Welcome, um, Rogers. 
This is going to be great for you, I'm sure. You can't doctor at all, but you can do all these other things, and I want you to oh, not hunt for now until we get something before you can construct, and you can smith, and you can craft. In fact, we want you to craft first. Okay, so he will get on whatever it is he wants to get on, which is going to be cutting stone, which is perfect. Okay, we don't need power yet, so hopefully nobody fuels that, because it would be a complete waste for now. No, we're going to have to mine all this for a wood wall. That ought to be good there. Well, we are at six meals that are in fact unrefrigerated, so we're going to want to get that. We'll set up a dining area in here. Um, then we'll just complete all this, because why not? The door here. And then we'll just put a wooden wall here for support. And that'll be perfect. Oh no, we need another bedroom already. That's insane. I was not expecting to need another bedroom so quickly. We we'll use that one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six wall. And a door. And a bed. Rogers, you are stargazing? Sure, that's fine. Alright, so anyway, that introduces the women here. With now, with Roger, the women and Roger. <clears throat> Hopefully, things will continue to go as well as they have been. We'll mine all this out uh, for the dining room, slash, whatever other kind of room we can think of. Put some production stuff over here. We will do carpet, and we will carpet. Uh, the bedrooms, the, this hallway, which I'm not entirely sure what we're going to do with yet. Um, we ought to put a door there, probably. Because um, there's no reason not to. That way they can just go from their bedroom right into that room. And we'll carpet all this. <coughs> Tail. There's, is there no more meat? And Rinnick is researching. Perfect. And hopefully she's learning to research more and more. Tail has nothing to do. Tail's our hunter. So we'll go ahead and we will hunt this. Oh, Rinnick's the hunter. Tail. What does Tail do? What does she love to do? Shooting? Crafting? She likes crafting? Crafting and stone cutting, smelting, and more. Okay. Well, we'll get her on something. Tail, you will do something. Oh, you know what you can do is start, is continue. Chop wood. Uh, wherever we can find wood. Through here. Perfect. Yeah. Alright. We're gonna pause here. I don't want this snake here. So that would be hunted. And so leave the snake alone, I guess. And we have a raid. So we will continue this next time. Thank you for watching. Uh, be sure to like and subscribe. Check out the last RimWorld series uh, with Randy Random and the spaceship we almost got. And join me on this one to see where we go and if we are able to walk to a spaceship. Catch you next time.